Hello everyone, welcome back. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about um, friction. Alright? But I'm gonna make different videos of friction. But today in this video, we are going to discuss mainly we're gonna focusing on the kinetic friction. Alright? Okay, we're gonna solve problems as well. Kinetic friction ke baki. You'll get to know what we're gonna study. If you haven't watched my days, equations, videos, derivation, and every material is being provided in this video, go watch it first. Right? We have done. The, we have derived the first equation of motion, and the first equation we have done. Right? This was the first equation of motion that we have done in here last video, and the, in the second last video we have done this. But third equation of motion is still remaining to be done. Um, I promise you, I'm gonna post that in few days, couple of days. I'm gonna make a video of uh, spin. One topic of chemistry is also many. I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna do that. Let's just jump to in our today's topic. All right. So, what does friction mean? Friction का मतलब होता क्या? Friction means इतने पहले सबसे पहले जो हम करते हैं तभी do is be right. Friction. ठीक है? Basically, friction means the force that oppose a body you will get to know what is that okay first of all um friction how can we define friction is a force that exists in pair pairs pairs can do sorry exist in pair all right it is a force that is known as action reaction force to action reaction force to this right action reaction force next up air is a force that oppose a relative motion what does this mean this is force that resist or you can say that oppose oppose basically means resist resist means to stop alright relative motion that oppose relative motion alright or you can say the tendency of relative motion relative motion ko karti hai ya phir relative motion ki tendency tendency basically means uh, motion hone wala alright so for example um, let's just consider a body body A the body A is moving in this direction and it is placed on a surface okay this is the surface this form body B ka naam hai. so the force that will be applying by B that will be in the opposite direction ye ho ki opposite direction ke andar. so we can write F the force hai, that would be in opposite direction F A B jo B A B laga raha hai and if the B body is moving there is taraf jari hai that way so jab A force lagayega to A force is taraf lagay means the body two body when it will be in contact they gonna create they gonna apply force on each other in the opposite of motion you never gonna say that apply motion always the frictional force is never opposite to the applied motion let me I'll give you the example this key be example hai. always the correct statement would be motion of force okay applied force ke upar frictional nahi hoga alright 
एंड वी नो दैट इट्स इट्स अ ऑपोजिट फोर्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल हाउ यू आर वॉकिंग आप चल किस तरह से रहें दिस इज यू वेन यू आर मूविंग फॉरवर्ड द ग्राउंड जिस ग्राउंड पे आप चल रहे हैं द ग्राउंड ऑपोजिट द फोर्स एंड दैट फोर्स इज नोन एज फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स इज ऑलवेज ऑलवेज देर वेयर मास इज देयर फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ आई गुड गिव यू द एग्जाम्पल वैक्यूम वैक्यूम है डू वी कैन वी से दैट वैक्यूम के अंदर फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स है कैन वी से दैट एग्जैक्टली नो बिकॉज देयर इज नो मास सो मै इट सम हाउ रिलेट विद मास इज वेल क्योंकि जहाँ पे मास नहीं होगा तो देर विल बी नो फ्रिक्शन राइट वी आर गोइंग टू फोकस ऑन अवर रिलेटिव मोशन सॉरी सॉरी आई एम सो सॉरी सो वी हैव टू टाइप्स ऑफ मोशन सॉरी हमारे पास टोरल वी हैव स्लाइडिंग रोलिंग स्टेरिंग इन काइनेटिक्स तो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस काइनेटिक्स मेनली वी गन फोकसिंग ऑन काइनेटिक्स राइट फर्स्ट हम गन कैल यू द डिफ्रेंसिएशन बिटवीन बोथ ऑफ दैम काइनेटिक right so steric basically mean when tendency of the related motion is there means you be here related motion is there tendency right there is tendency tendency of related motion is there what does that mean for example the motion that is going to be occurring jo motion hone wali ho aur bodies jo hongi wo hamesha rest mein hongi For example, um, I have a box over here, and I am gonna apply force over there. Force means direction में लगा रही, but the box is not moving. The box is not covering the displacement. क्योंकि इसके ऊपर frictional force लग रही है. That is why it is said to be in rest. So basically, steric words mean rest, and uh, it's just a tendency. मतलब frictional force allow नहीं कर रही है. ऑब्जेक्ट को मूव करने के वे एज वी टॉक अबाउट काइनेटिक तो देर रिलेटिव मोशन रिलेटिव मोशन इज देयर ठीक है रिलेटिव मोशन होता है एंड दिस काइनेटिक मोशन और लाइक यू कैन से काइनेटिक फ्रिक्शन इज मोशन को भी कह सकते हैं हम राइट नाउ Kinetic friction is always constant. You need to remember this. It's always constant. All right. Next up, um, kinetic friction, which we call F K, to represent it, that is directly proportional to the normal reaction. All right. Normal reaction is just directly proportional. Then, let's if we remove this. Uh, proportionality sign we add a constant and that is f k is equal to mu mu k normal reaction all right now this is the formula to calculate the kinetic friction right that this kinetic friction does not depend on anything it does not change all right and here this is the coefficient of kinetic friction all right which uh, is always in the surface the surface we come for that okay so now we're going to solve few problems hum ek problems we're going to solve that all right that is consider a body that has a 4 kg mass that is 4 kg mass so sorry that is a 4 kg mass for it and the force that is being applied to this body is 10 newton okay 
and uh, now we need to find what is the frictional force frictional force kya hai right so for finding the frictional force acha we need to clear one more thing here and uh, the value of mu is given over here is 0.2 all right so no when there will be no vertical reaction so the natural acha you can see here ki hamare paas in the kinetic frictional formula we have this what is this this is normal reaction so there is no value of normal reaction all right because when there is no vertical reaction so the normal reaction would be is equal to g for example force ji ho jayega yahan pe okay aur upar ki tarah force lag rahi hai that is neutral so now we're going to put the values right let's just place the values f k mu k n 0.2 multiply by 4 multiply by g all right multiply by g so did you get it the force that we that will be over here the opposite force the frictional force that would be applying to this body would be 8 newton 8 newton ki force now the question the question ask you about to calculate the acceleration how you going to calculate the acceleration all right let me just redraw the diagram over here 4 kg mass hai 8 newton friction lag rahi hai right and uh, here hum force khud laga rahe hain that is 10 newton how we going to calculate so 10 minus 8 is equal to acceleration mass into acceleration 4 multiplied by 8 we need the value of acceleration acceleration is equal to 2 upon 4 that would be equal to 0.5 meter per second square all right i hope this is clear theek okay? hai um in the next video i hope you gonna be covering this steric friction and then i'm gonna move towards the types all right that we have rolling so it's sliding rolling and limiting friction so we're going to discuss the conditions over there in the next video thank you for watching